We the kings of the tailgate. Empire O. We the tailgate kings. Everybody move slow. We the kings of the tailgate. Haters lay low when you step into the throne. Show love. Hey, what's up? It's your boy 49er Tone. Back with a video talking a little boxing today on Conversations with Tone. And if you follow the sport of boxing, huge news just came out today uh, with the purse bid of arguably the undisputed lightweight champion. I do say arguably because of Devin Haney. However you look at it, Teofimo Lopez is the man that beat the man. But his purse bid with Cambosos today and the app Triller. Now, I know you heard of Triller because of the huge pay-per-view success of Mike Tyson and Roy Jones exhibition uh, in December, this past December. They put up $6 million for this fight. Now, that's huge, huge news, especially with Lopez promoter, top rank, you know, Bob Arum came out saying this wasn't a big fight. And obviously, they didn't come nowhere near uh, the dollar amount that the app trailer just put out um but man six million dollars now match room uh put a bid in i believe it was 3.5 million uh top rank put one that was less than that but trailer came out i mean it, it there was talks of them before of them putting some money up but what was that dollar amount and they put up a boatload of money for this fight and, man, I'm happy for Lopez, man. He beat uh, Lomachenko on ESPN this past October, uh, took all the belts, uh, made a name for himself. He was talking about getting a big payday. You know, Bob Arum was saying this wasn't a big fight. And Lopez is getting paid. So I'm happy for him, man. I I'm just interested with the whole trailer situation because, We've seen their production on the Mike Tyson and Roy Jones exhibition, and it was a success. It was a success all the way around. It was their first uh, fight, you know, that they put on, um, then get into boxing. Um, and it looks like they're very serious with this, man. Six million dollars. So ESPN, I know they're not happy losing Lopez in his first fight back you know, after putting up a big ratings number and, and you know, uh, making a, a household name for himself on, on ESPN with the Loma Tranquil fight. And, you know, where does where, where does he go with top rank with this? Man, how, you know, Bob Arum holds a lot of grudges. You know, who knows, you know, where they go from here, you know? And, uh, but the whole Triller situation, you know, I was thinking, like, how are they going you know, they, are they putting this on pay-per-view? How much was the dollar amount for this pay-per-view? The production, if they, they're keeping the same production, that it was a great production on the exhibition. You know, they had the Snoop Dogg, everybody loves Snoop Dogg on there. Um, but as an exhibition, it wasn't the most professional broadcast, you know what I mean? And I'm, I'm very interested how, how, you know, how this is going to work. Um, you know, the, of course, there's rumors of Mike Tyson and a vendor Holyfield, a third fight ex exhibition. You know, that's a, that's a big dollar, uh, you know, big dollar fight. They put that as, you know, will they put the Lopez fight on that undercard? Will that be the co-main event? Um, that's going to be a big pay-per-view. You know, there's a lot of money to be spread it around. <clears throat> Maybe that six million dollars is part of that. Um, that it's going to be interesting to see, man. I, I'm very, very, very shocked <laughs> that they put up $6 million, but I'm very happy for Lopez, man. Uh, props to you. And Cambosos is getting what close to 2 million, maybe a little more, you know, he's getting a, a, a life changing payday. Hey, I'm all for, I'm all for the fighters getting paid. So great, great news, man. That, that was definitely interesting. I, I, and I'm definitely interested to see what kind of avenue this was going to be going forward man this was a big big step man and uh trailer trailer made it happen so but yeah that was the big news with the purse bid uh obviously this is canelo week um you know canelo and yeardham on uh the zone uh you know anytime you see a pound for pound great 
uh, pound for pound top fighter or world champion staying active. I'm all for it, man. I, I like these fighters to stay active. I, I, I'm tired of the one fights per year, like a Gary Russell Jr. You know what I mean? Like, I, I'm tired of the these one fights per year, man. You know, and, and Canelo just fought in December uh, in, in a big fight on the zone. Uh, he dominated, and he's coming right back, a quick turnaround. And he made that deal with Eddie Hearn to go ahead and make this deal on the zone. And then in May, Billy Joe Saunders. Uh, and then hopefully in September, we'll, we'll see, but hopefully we'll get the Kayla Plant Canelo fight in September. So, you know, big year ahead for Canelo. Um, you're not going to fight killers every single fight if you're going to stay this active, but man, I, I'm anytime you want, you get to see a top fighter, a great fighter, a pound for pound fighter apply his trade, man. It's, it's definitely, uh, worth watching. So I got the zone. I'll be watching this Saturday. And then, of course, PBC on Fox, you got the Darrell fight. Uh, I'll be having that on the DVR and then watch that right after the Canelo fight. I, I, I You know, a lot of people don't like multiple shows going going on, um, but I do because I can always record one, stay off the phone, watch one card, and then go to the next one. It's a whole night of fights. Just like this past week with the Adrian Broner fight, I had that recorded and uh, was watching the Burchell Valdez, so... Uh, live. So for me, I, I love it. That's a whole night of fights for me. But, you know, it's Canelo week, man. I I'm excited. Uh, not the greatest fight, obviously. I expect him to do his thing, uh, dominate, knock him out. Um, but it's just uh, it's just good to see a top fighter like that staying that active. So, you know, we'll see, man. And then, you know, Tyson Fury, Anthony Joshua, who knows what's going on with that, man. I really hope we get that fight, um, but, you know, we, we're going to see where that one goes. But anyway, it's your boy 49er Tone. Got some 49er videos coming up, man, but I also got some boxing vids too, man, and then, of course, some other sports. If you do, if you want to, uh, uh, if you follow boxing, man, go ahead and hit that like button, thumbs up button, man, for me. Comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think of this fight, man uh with canelo and then let me know what you think of the purse bid where does trailer go from here man the, this was big news you know let me know man but i got some more uh stuff coming man for my 49er fans and uh yeah we're just gonna keep it like that man but hit that thumbs up uh comment subscribe man come interact with me man and follow me on twitter at 49er tone all right holla at your boy